this is a collaborative effort between physicians, biostatisticians, data scientists, epidemiologists, radiologists, to really coalesce, to come together around a common goal, which is the early detection of pancreatic cancer. Pancreatic cancer, although relatively rare, is the third leading cause of cancer-related death in the United States. A lot of this has to do with the fact that we don't have helpful screening methods for detecting pancreas cancer before it's in its latest stages. So the real challenge in uh, screening for pancreatic cancer is that in many cases, by the time someone presents with symptoms, it's far too late. Uh, so that being the case, we really want to hone in on any signals. The electronic medical record is really a powerful tool where we're really able to now take that data and use it to really apply new therapies. And this is a frontier in terms of personalized medicine. So what we've seen is that folks you know, between the ages of 50 and 85 that develop diabetes for the first time, that's a potential marker for pancreatic cancer. And so now we want to take the, the next step. The new onset hyperglycemia and diabetes study, otherwise known as NOD, is a consortium. The emphasis here is really to try to understand more about how high blood sugar could be an early sign of pancreatic cancer. Research is really important in order to help us try to identify this cancer in an earlier stage when it can still be treated and potentially cured.